So hello and a warm welcome to all of you worldwide. We're just waiting for the central characters to make their appearance and then we will be underway. I'm Peter Drury and joining me here, our expert, Jim Beglin. Glad to be here, Peter, and I'm ready to rumble. to the wing played into the mid gets up to head it forward it goes Southampton are on fine form so far as goals are concerned they have scored in five games running keeper's got good distance on that tries to get it forward quickly Who's got the final touch there? Goal kick's been given. Floats one over. Away from immediate danger. Coleman with the ball through. Jean. Jean. Up to meet it! No, not the best of headers. Dinks one in. Jean. Jean delivers. If you have just joined us, well, you've missed no goals. Played out to the wing. Uh, Can he score? And a second time. Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. Yeah, he may have snatched it down a bit, even though it was quite close. Hoists it high. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. He's gone for it. And that is going to be the final action of the first half. So another team has broken through. It's Boggle in the box. It's Man United. It's a good game up to now. It hasn't had to shut for you, mate. Goals. So they head in no further forward. The score here, still nil-nil. And we're already back underway here. Goes for it! Southampton come here off the back of that high... Gabbiadini! And that would have been some goal. Manolo Gabbiadini cannot be a happy chappy and you can understand why the run was stoic and it should have been heroic has a pop and that really should have hit the net well he did get himself into a good position something for him to cling to long and high towards the flank Lamina spreads it wide some astute defending to ensure they got no further one. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Looks to clip it forward. Concentration levels are very... Shoots! He's done very well to get... And that's that. A frustrating game for attackers on either side. They hardly had a sniff. Defence is broadly in charge. And it has finished goalless.
soaking up the pre-match atmosphere here as we wait for things to get started. Won't be long now before we get through the formalities. A warm welcome one and all. I'm Peter Drury and providing analysis and expert opinion alongside me will be Jim Beglin. Hi Peter, always good to work with you. I'm really looking forward to this now. Things have got underway here pretty promptly. Gets wrestled off the ball. And he heaves it forward. Bolton were imperious when the two sides last. Shot at goal! Ren Adelaide. Bolton have their manager to thank for the last result. Yeah, he had a problem, but he was confident he had the players to fix it. And his willingness to take risks is what... I'm Shoots! Goal! Deadlock broken. It's 1-0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. So they got the only goal to give them a 1-0. The shot's on! Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gent. He'll have a dip! What about it? And they are disappearing out of sight. That second goal is... And there's the end of the first half. Any strong opinions on the first half? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position. So why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? It has been a remarkable contest, decorated by goals. And two between them at half-time.
whistle goes and we start the second half good defending he knew he had to stop it right there good challenge he just stood firm well out of late two goals ahead and looking comfortable looking to shoot great ball to play him in but he will be gutted to miss that the timing of the pass and run was exquisite played out to the wing a couple of changes then in quick succession that's a poor kick by the keeper he's just he's had a shot they are rampant and they are cruising away three without reply this is becoming a stroll has a pop it's there more and more and more and more they are running riot long and high towards the flank he could have been in just needed a better final ball ah quality deserted them when they really needed it spreads it wide great leap goal well just an added time is up and there goes the whistle a demolition destruction annihilation they simply ran away with it so what do you take away from it all jim yeah they had a game plan which was about hammering away in central positions and it paid off for me they were persistent and ruthless thanks to jim alongside me Welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here. Just waiting for the players to emerge and we will be underway. And we're underway. Battles to win it back. Loose ball, who's going to get there? Going for goal! There it is! Barnsley grab an early lead. Good start. It's and shoots! Well, the ball's come loose and the chip has a shot! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Chip through, has a swing at it! He's got away with one there. Well, I think the opposition was pretty sloppy in creating a problem for themselves then, but he was onto it so quickly and, and very nearly made them pay. So what's he planning here? Shakes the shoots. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Away from immediate danger. Yeah. 
tries, gets up to head it, sticks it away. And we hit half time. Genuinely interesting game here. Very, very watchable. Two goals, one each. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Well, we thought this would be close, Peter, and it's it's proving us right so far. They're well matched, and it, it presents a, a fascinating shoots. No, not quite. Well, Peter, I would say it was worth a try. Steered out wide, and he's cut it out. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No, it's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. Someone looks like he's in need of protection here. Yeah, and the he's gone for it! Turns and goes, he's had a shot! And he's there to make a great save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Now the pass. Up for the header! And somehow he managed to miss it. Well, maybe the tension around this game played a part in that because he should have put them ahead then. Oh, he really wanted that. Yeah, and you can feel and hear how the crowd are reacting to all of this. That's a poor kick by the keeper. He's just given it straight back. And time is up. Well, nobody is totally satisfied, but it was a, a more than decent game, a super watch, and it ends in a draw. Well, after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Yeah, this looked the most likely outcome, but we've had a, a good... The warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. I'm your commentator, Peter Drury, and providing his unique brand of expert analysis, here's Jim Beglin. Thanks, Peter. Hello, everybody. Uh, ready to see what unfolds in this one now. Things have got underway here pretty prompt. Massive leap! He's delivered all right! Listen, scoring early doesn't guarantee you anything, but the first... Looking to shoot! Oh, surely that deserved better. It's easy to say it, but difficult to stop it when runs in behind her are being made like that. Up to meet it! Just off target. A more than decent attempt, Peter. It's... He's had a go! That's a half-decent try. Very speculative with little threat, if any, for the keeper. He's made sure that that won't get through. Shoots! Good hit, kept the keeper honest. Oh, he's gone for it! Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. We're talking fine margins, very fine margins. 
Aimed low and direct. Plays a clever pass. He's hit one! Oh, no shortage of confidence there. Well, the run was really impressive. The finish was depressive and expectations were not met. More pressure on the opposition goal. Goes for it! And that's it for the first half. A breathless ending. And there we are. Off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Some first-half thoughts? Well, you can debate, Peter, whether they deserve a slightly bigger lead because they've created the majority of the chances. But they are in front for a reason, and they'll be confident of, of cementing that from now. Leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments, and it's 1-0 at the break. Here we go again then. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball. Up for a header! No, not the best of headers. Sheffield have come to the defence of their manager after he came in for some stick regarding some of his decision-making. Look, some has a pop! In it goes! Two to the good! They have breathing space! Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. How about it? More and more and more and more. They are running riot. And the lead is extended still further. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Sheffield uh, keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. He'll have a dip! It's there! Yet another goal in an awesome performance! They are in complete charge! And that is that. A demolition, destruction, annihilation. They simply ran away with it. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Yeah, they had a game plan which was about hammering away in central positions and it paid off. For me, they were persistent and ruthless. Well, that's it from us. Thanks very much, Jim.